The giant new rocket from SpaceX blasted off this morning and then minutes later it blew up and crashed right into the Gulf of Mexico. The SpaceX team is still touting its successful liftoff, however, saying they're very hopeful for the future. ABC's Melissa Adon has more on what happened. The most powerful rocket in the world successfully lifting off Thursday morning. We're flying at twice the thrust. Of the, the excitement of Starship followed by moments of uncertainty. Okay, we should have had separation by now. And the rocket's explosion. <laughs> The major explosion, not part of the plan. The booster was supposed to peel away from the spacecraft three minutes after liftoff, but that didn't happen. Instead, the rocket with the spacecraft still attached began to tumble and then exploded. The FAA says an anomaly occurred during the ascent and prior to stage separation, resulting in loss of the vehicle. I would assume that because the rocket was not in control, not going where it's supposed to, that it was actually triggered to explode. SpaceX confirming by the afternoon they did indeed terminate the flight as it was veering off its planned trajectory. The debris fell somewhere in the Gulf of Mexico and SpaceX says it'll work with local authorities for recovery. Starship has a goal to take humans back and forth to the moon and beyond. The SpaceX team saying this will give them a lot to learn. Elon Musk tweeting his congratulations to the team for an exciting test launch of Starship, saying learned a lot for the next test launch in a few months. Musk says his plan is to send Starship into Earth's orbit to see if the rocket can get to space. With 33 engines and 16 million pounds of thrust, twice as powerful as NASA's largest rocket, the SLS. In this video, you can see debris flying as Starship took off. The FAA says they'll oversee the mishap investigation of the Starship Super Heavy test mission, sharing how no injuries or damage have been reported. Melissa Don, ABC News, Los Angeles.